Generic greetings and welcome back once again to the generic prisoner holding facility that is 100% non-violent, non-eventful and is also happy. Today's lie also accompanies with a very nice beverage of a banana smoothie. Very nice indeed. And welcome back to the game. Previously, well, we got prisoners and it kicked off. I think that is the basic interpretation. I think the overall accurate interpretation. So, yeah, welcome to the facility where we have, at the moment anyway, a total of 18 Supermax legendary prisoners, which basically meant that we had several fights, escape attempts, deaths, etc. It was basically not ideal. So, yeah, in this episode we need to continue on and build and hopefully try and calm it down via the application of breathe therapy and then also the chapel, which is going to go in here. So let's just go ahead and do some of that. The main issue we have is actually funding. Um, I've got 19 grand and we are getting, yeah, minus uh, 6,000 almost. Well, no, uh, 5,590 generic units of currency. Basically, it's not enough. Uh, Reoffending rate, if we got that under... <laughs> don't even know why I'm looking at reoffending rate. Um, average reoffending rate is 95%. Hmm... I'm not convinced we're going to do that, Grant. I'm also not convinced the the, the prisoners are going to take it well uh, when we end up changing the the meal quantity and variety to low. So let's see how we get on. Anyway, we're just going to max speed this out and we want to go ahead and build the chapel because I think that would be a bonus thing to do. They obviously are building over here as well, the gym mats. That's the one I want to get more than any other, the, the brief therapy. And oh, we've got a kick off. So this is Wyatt Burrows here who is currently fighting. However, Benji, the armed guard, is not taking... Yeah, they're really not... Uh... <clears throat> they're really not taking any of that nonsense however sadly Puppa is well they've been taken out so let's go ahead and do some guard responsing but to be fair by the time you get the guards there it's it's already things have already happened so this person is it says they are rioting and they immediately just take away that gun wow uh, luckily this is a bit of a a bit of a curious thing here um, the the prisoners who are extremely deadly and this is I'm, I'm not 100% not 100% on this but if the prisoner is extremely deadly they're actually just better with fists because there's a chance just to immediately take someone out whereas the gun is the set amount of damage I think that's how it works but either way um, we need to continue on there is some of the gym mats put in which is nice we are getting what on earth oh Dan, they, yeah, again, killed by a guard for being a cop killer, so the guards were not stopping. Do we need to hire any more? Mm, I think we need another dog handler. Basically, we're going to just keep buying dog handlers. It just seems to be the nature of the beast with this thing. I definitely want, in order to just conti continue the series, legal prep, because that just allows us to have that extra bit, but I don't think it's going to happen. So a lot of prisoners are saying that they are... Uh, yeah, that they are at their boiling point. The boiling point is at max level. This is the danger level. But these needs are fulfilled. So it's just, it's just the curious case of the uh, of the mutator settings that we have activated. I'm just gonna double check something. Um, that's gate's fine. Those gates are fine. It was the uh, wiring. I'm I'm sure I connected it up, but I wanted to make sure. Yeah, that door server is is indeed connected. So we do have free fire on. We do have guard towers there and indeed there, which for some reason none of the snipers are at. Oh, there's one of the snipers who is moving over there. That is that is nice of them. We are receiving four more super max, which is handy. Oh, look, more prisoners and more to deal with. <laughs> yes, look, they're all legendary. What a surprise. Oh, we don't have many legendary. Oh, oh, wait. Okay, so <laughs> that's all fine. Um, I do want to put in a, a, a walkway across here. Oh, hang on, wait, all the gym mats are in. So over to our programs, and we're going to scroll down, and we are going to run the Breathe Therapy. So there we go, and that is set up. We're just going to continue on there, because it says seven interested. I'm going to put more of those in, and I think that's it. It says... Uh, each participant requires a gym mat, voluntarily can hire externally, students sit, repeatable teachers sit, it requires a gym mat, gang members can attend, and it's easy. So there you go, let's see if this is going to work. And there's a Matt McKenzie who's sitting on uh, the bleachers there uh, using the dumbbells. So that's now running, the programs are running here with a disarming certification, not that that seems to be doing a whole amount of... Uh, 
<laughs> There's not. We haven't had a huge amount of success with that one. And oh, they're doing breathe therapy. Yes, they are. There we go. Oh, nice. And there's the teacher, who I don't expect will leave for various reasons. Oh, look at that. Let's just keep an eye on it then. I want to see if it genuinely gives them an effect. They have the current status effect of well-fed. Yes, that's the case. And they're doing the breathe therapy. Now, naturally, some of them are a little bit vexed. But that's working, I think. Attendance is good. Success chance is low. But it's better than nothing. It's better than not attempting it, surely. Okay, over to the chapel. Let's get this built. I'm just going to pause it for a moment while we put in the... Um, we put in the altar there. And then the pews, which I often get mm, mixed up. Is that right? I think that's correct. I'm actually going to put a bit of a gap between because, well, we can. And then prayer mats as well. You need prayer mats. So we can put prayer mats... Technically, you need a prayer mat, so I'm just going to put the prayer mat in the corner there. And that should be that. Oh, hang on, wait. We have... Mark. Who is... Going after the dog. Why do they always target the dogs? How could you target that face? Look at that. I mean, they may have defecated in your flower bed, but you wouldn't kick off. Anyway, how are we doing over here? Oh, success chance is going up. Attendance, 90%. 92, 3. And that's it. Let's have a quick look then. So, Matt Burgess, for example. Experience. Brief therapy. Success chance, nothing. Okay, what about Fairburn? Oh, well fed. Mm, this guy. Brief therapy. Success chance, nothing. Okay. Well, we're trying. There you go. That's going up. Oh dear. Gangs are making their t oh, marking their territory. Uh, yeah. Okay. So that's been marked. Send a janitor when it's safe to deal with it. It's never safe to deal with it. It's never safe to deal with it in here. It's never safe to deal with it normally. So, hmm. We can clean it up. Left click to clean. Plus 15 strength when in territory for gang members. Plus 50% toughness. I'll be honest, that's a drop in the ocean compared to all the legendary traits anyway. So, I'm not going to concern myself over with it. Let's concern myself with that one. Anyway, we're going to put in another serving table. I think that would be uh, prudent to do so. The issue is that we are have, we have a daily cash flow of 5,000. So, we're just, we're just losing money. We're just losing money. And the only way to fix it is my to get more to get more prisoners, basically. And well, is that even possible? Well, yeah, it's certainly possible. Once we build these areas, which we can't, we don't have the money to do so. Uh, I've just attended. I've just done uh, breathe therapy, and now I'm going to try and jump over a wall. They say, uh, and they've also taken out an armed guard. Because of course they have. We'll hire those again. Um, right, so the chapel's getting built. The why are all these guys here? Lockdown. Solitary, solitary, solitary. Twenty-eight hours. But they're just they're just like laying here. Let's keep an eye on it for a second to see if any of them have shifted at all. So one's been brought in to be healed, which the doctor seems to be totally unconcerned with. I guess they are slowly healing with the medical bed. If I set these up as solitary, I'm fairly confident I have. Ten. Yeah. Yes, we have. Do we simply not have enough solitary? I think it said half of them were used. Okay. I, I actually have no idea why the why they're doing that. I'm just going to end the punishment. Deployment's fine. I've ended punishment and they are not... Hmm. They're not being escorted else anywhere. 
Okay. That is... Cause for concern. Why are they not moving? I know the I know the medical beds look comfy. But still. Where's that at? Oh, in there. Danger level's actually gone down, which is good. <clears throat> hmm. This is this is very much a cause for concern. Okay. Change cell. Choose new cell. So they they are there. So if I move the, move the prison at that cell. There we go. They're not being escorted. Lead one of the gangs in the prison is currently being punished. Ah, right. Okay. So if we don't stop the punishment. Their gang is going to kick off. So I will end punishment. We've got enough problems on our hands anyway. Okay. Let's move away from that and we'll we'll continue on with with this stuff. So we want to go with um, doors and it'll be a... I think we're going to go with a double door. It would be nice to have a double door there. Mm, it's going to be a jail door though, isn't it? In red, with a door servo. In, hang on, where would it be? There. Yes. And then we need some flooring in here. So I think... I think I'm not going to put any flooring in. We don't have the funds available. Oh, hang on. Don't know if you saw there, because we were, yeah, Matt Burgess. There was a sniper line from here, all the way to there. So they try to run out. That's why I guess having them around here is actually a good thing. And now they're exhausted after one shot and they're going back. Oh, good grief. Right. So these guys are getting searched. And healed. Hmm. I'll have to keep an eye on that one. See how we get on. So. That's now set up. The electrical connection is not in. But wiring should be possible. With the door wiring from there to there another fight as well peter hogg mm -hmm. anyway how we're doing for inmate nutritional research actually we're doing quite well we're on 81 percent for three high variety high quantity meals which is why a lot of them are the suppressed and surrendered or some of the recent ones, and there will be some well-fed traits. Maybe not now because it's very early in the morning, so it's been a while since they've had, yeah, any food. And it looks like Matt McKenzie is fighting, as is Richard Sadler, and the guards are already on it. Guards are on it, and that is oh, okay. So I don't know if you saw that guard there, Harry. Is it Harry? Hmm. Let's see if there's any ranks. There's no ranks on normal guards. Oh, sorry, there's only ranks on normal guards. There's no ranks on any of the armed guards. So let's have a quick look. Rank. Specialist officer. And I sacked them beforehand. <laughs> Typical. Um, Carly rank. They can't rank up. Rank? No. Rank. So we can't get higher ranks. Even though we can select ranks, that means that we can increase their rank. But you can only have a certain amount. So I think that's what's happened there. Alright. So, let's go ahead and run. Spiritual Guidance. Six in the queue. The next one would be Behavioral Therapy. Behavioral Therapy. What is the best way to do Behavioral Therapy? So, behavioural therapy needs to be run. Mm, I'll let the guards deal with that. So, 200 per session, one place, five sessions. Intermediate. I don't think it's going to work, but the fact that several of the inmates want to do it, it, it's curious. Gang rehabilitation as well, led by a psychologist in an office. 
faith program. Spiritual leader in a chapel. Can only be done by gangs. Start. Fight club. These training sessions are meant to direct your inmates' destructive energy into fighting in a controlled environment. Hmm. Led by a gym instructor in a fight club. I don't know what the best course of action would be. Gang rehabilitation would be good. And that would pair up with... That's seven in the queue. That would pair up with the behavioural therapy, which is five in the queue. But considering we are... All rooms are staff only. That's not true. It is It is true. Uh, okay. Shared. Reschedule. There we go. So we've got Breathe Therapy, which reduces that. We've got Faith Program and Spiritual Guidance. That's also going to work. But we'd need to build some offices. The only pl place we have is here. And we could easily do that. Uh, four, office. Four, office. Three, nothing. So we could have two offices here with entrances from the, fa uh, from the infirmary. We could do that. That is possible. The other option is we don't do... <clears throat> yeah. We don't do... The... Mm. Maybe we don't do that. We don't. We don't bother with the psychological approach. We do fight club. Meant to direct your inmates' destructive energy into fighting in a controlled environment. It seems more fitting. Fight club. Minimum size five by five. Well, you know what? Let's maybe have five there. All right. So we couldn't get other officers in the back, but we could have a fight club. I mean, we have to try everything, surely. Right. But again, it's going to cost, isn't it? It's more cost. And the, the cash flow. I mean, I, I will be taking out bank loans to shore this prison up. <laughs> yes. Let's just uh, debt ourselves. <laughs> Out of this one. So I need to double check then. Programs and Fight Club. Um, fight Club, Fight Club, Fight Club. Instructor. A gym instructor. So what we'd have to do is... If this was going to be a f uh, an office... We'd have to have a way for the visitor to come through. Which means we're going to have to have a wall across there. Wall across there. Then that can go down and then there. Then this will be maybe... Maybe a way for parole or something like that. How many would you for parole out of interest? I'm going to guess absolutely nobody. Well, two. I mean, they're not going to get through parole, so I don't see any point. But there you go. Right. Over to our walls and doors and to doors. Oh, no, let's let's put in the doors around here first because that would be the prudent course of action. So this is going to be a fight club, and this doesn't have a. This currently doesn't have any purpose. And we'll have a visitor door in there, and we'll have a jail door red because we're using. Actually, no, we'll just have a jail door, jail door in there. Oh, do you want a secret door? Actually, <laughs> uh, where is it? Door secret. I mean solid white wall with a line and then there's a bookcase there. It, it's actually the opposite of sort of secret, isn't it? So it can go there. I'm putting the entrance close to the infirmary just because it seems to be what's going to be necessary. Over to utilities and wiring. We're going to have a door control servo there. That's a door servo. And then obviously we're going to have to then connect that up to the grid. And here requires a bit of power, so we'll run that as well. And... Yeah, more prisoners as well. Let's just double check. I wonder what type of prisoners they are. Oh, the legendary. Wow, okay. That's that's pretty good. How are we doing for gang members as well? Oh, actually, not as bad as I thought. We've got five bone breakers, which are red. And then we've got a viper gang member as well. So there we are. And we're not, they're not picking up that inmate. I think it's because that this, is this is genuinely just full. Okay, 
I'm going to save and load because we really need to see if that's uh, the issue. Okay, upon load, it appears that this has done absolutely nothing. I'm going to have to look into that further. But yeah, basically, we have them pretty much stuck there. I don't think it's an issue when it comes to... Well, we're going to have to get, let's get another doctor and make it even... Make the daily cash flow problem worse. I don't think that is the issue. I'm genuinely not sure at this stage. But anyway, we have got this getting built. We'll have the door in with the servo. And this is the fight club. So let's go for fight club. And this is the fight club room, which requires, if we check out objects here, it is a fight ring. Now, a fight ring is different to a boxing ring. Um, as you can see, it's, it's actually a little bit smaller. So if we go over to fight there, if we go over to boxing ring, the boxing ring is much larger. It's Well, it's, yeah, it's just one larger either side but a fight ring uh, we can place in the corner there so it's just a, a slightly smaller version of that in terms of the oh because i've done a load oh yes uh yeah inmate nutritional research i'm gonna have to start from scratch because it does forget <laughs> it does forget some of the grants i see no point in attempting that if we can't do it in one hit Oh well, uh, let's see how we get on. So, we've got this getting built. The The danger level is medium, and it is increasing, but not at a rate that I would have expected, which is curious. Uh, the problem is we have a couple of people unconscious, and that's because they're in the infirmary. Um, let's see if we can... Let's see if we can fix this. Well, there is a way to fix it. It's placing medical beds, but... One, two, three, four... Five, six. Let's see if we can get that done. Um, looks like the fight rings in, so we can go for programs down to the bottom here. And it is Fight Club. Ten interested. We'll start that. Let's see how many it puts in there. It appears to put one, two, three, four. It puts six in. Oh, hang on. Whoa. See that? I didn't order the janitor to clean that, but he's done it. All right. That's, um... That's curious. And danger level is now going down. And now we are healing these inmates here. So. Oh, is that the fifth program? Yeah, nobody's attending that one. Oh no, two people are attending that one. Also a bit of a fight. As Pratt is climbing over the fence. I mean, I didn't appreciate a guy response. The sniper's got them. Okay. So, we have Fight Club. We have two programs running in the chapel. We have the Breathe Therapy. I don't know whether it's... Oh, yeah, one gang member is mad because of the graffiti cleaned, which we didn't order, but the janitor took upon himself and did the right thing, I guess, to clean that up. Hmm. Very curious. Very curious indeed. Let me wire that door control system up. It's not been as violent as the last episode. Well, not much could be. But that's a good thing. We have a prison karma, danger level decreasing. Everything's sort of, at the moment, okay. A couple of issues. This, which you'll have to look at, because that's a failure state if we can't get these prisoners away. And it, it probably is just a simple thing that I'm missing. Is that the doggo? Yes, that is the doggo. Take it out. And where's Matt McKenzie running to? Is he attempting a blitz out attempt out the front door? Yes, there was an attempt made. So yeah, this is a problem. The main problem is money. We're spending five grand a day. We've got three and a half. That's unattainable. So we need to make some. We need to make some money somehow. I don't know what that answer is. We're going to leave it there. And next episode, we'll see if we can fix that. Hmm. Good sides and bad sides, I guess. Oh, ah, hang on. Is it cell quality ratings? No, use cell quality ratings is off. So if that was on, that would 
that's why these can't shift. I don't know. I'm sure it's an obvious answer. Let me know in the comments if you do know. Either way, next episode, we will look at trying to uh, basically balance the books and indeed keep the prison from absolutely destroying itself. As always, hope you have enjoyed the episode and the series thus far. Comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.